There's a common misconception that iOS security is somehow impenetrable to malware. It would be great if this were true, but unfortunately, it isn't. If you suspect your device is already infected, no worries. I'll show you exactly how to recognize it and how to remove viruses from iPhone. First, let's dive a bit deeper into why iPhones can be infected with malware. While iOS is generally less susceptible to malware than other operating systems, it's in no way immune. Adware or clicking on malicious links is always feasible, so additional protection against any human error on your device is essential. Now, you may be wondering, but how can I tell if my iPhone is infected with malware already? The most common symptoms can be overheating, quick battery drain, extreme data usage, unfamiliar suspicious apps on your phone, and phone crashing, just to name a few. Now, none of these symptoms, if isolated, are an immediate red flag and proof that your phone is crawling with malware. For example, if your device is old, it's only natural that it will need to be charged more frequently. So next time your phone starts overheating in your hand, think about it, is this really YouTube's fault? Thankfully, there are ways to make your device virus-free again. First, I'd advise you to update your iOS if you're not running the latest version. To update, go to Settings, General, Software Updates, Automatic Updates. This will ensure that you're running the latest and most secure version of iOS, which should handle any malware you have on your phone. If this doesn't resolve the issue you're experiencing, let's move on to the second thing we can do, which is removing any suspicious apps on your device. And if this still doesn't help, the most effective but also the most undesirable option is simply resetting your iPhone. It'll get rid of all the viruses. And if you sync your data with iCloud, no photos or other important documents will be lost. So it'll just take some time, which is a small price to pay to safeguard your device again. Let me show you how to restore your iPhone really quickly. First, let's head to Settings, then tap on General. Then scroll down to the very bottom and tap Transfer or Reset iPhone. After that, let's tap on Erase All Content and Settings. Your iPhone will take some time to restore, so wait it out and set it up again. Great your device is now free of malware. It's good that you can fix your device this way, but admittedly, it's not the most convenient for iPhone virus removal. This is where antivirus software comes into the spotlight. It's the ultimate tool to combat any threats on your devices, and I'll teach you how to use that too. To start using an antivirus on your iPhone, you'll first need to get a subscription. My recommendation is Total AV. Simply scan the QR code on screen, and you'll get a heavily discounted deal. That said, other providers like Norton or Bitdefender are also some of my top choices. You can't go wrong with either of these reputable providers. For the sake of this tutorial, I'll show you what using Total AV looks like on my testing device. But installing and using either of the other antiviruses is really simple too, as their user interfaces are also very much alike. To start using an antivirus, you'll first need to get an app from the Apple Store. After the antivirus of your choice is downloaded, open it and create an account or log in with your Apple ID. I chose the latter option because it's a hassle-free way to log in. Now that we're in, let me show you what running an iPhone virus scan on Total AV looks like. To start a scan, tap the magnifier and a smart scan will run. It didn't take long at all for me and I was quickly shown the results, urging me to take action. As you can see, the web shield feature wasn't enabled on my testing device, which is a critical feature to have. It blocks malicious phishing and scam websites. All of these are primary threats to your security when using an iPhone, so I always keep WebShield enabled on my personal phone. But this is not the only way Total AV protects your device. Its additional features like breach scan, real-time protection, and an ad blocker are strong reinforcements for your digital security too, so make sure to explore the app to stop any iPhone virus from ever infecting your device. However, I do have some other tips for keeping your iPhone safe. First, keep your software updated to its newest version. This ensures that your device runs the latest security releases from the developers themselves, which is crucial. Keeping real-time protection enabled 24-7 on an antivirus like Total AV is equally important because it blocks any threats as soon as they attempt to infect your device. Lastly, make sure to scan your device regularly to ensure that it's safe and sound. In the end, my answer to the question, can iPhones get viruses, is yes. They definitely can be infected with malware and malicious trackers. But if you take your security seriously and reinforce it with an antivirus, you will have nothing to worry about. I'm leaving the best discount for Total AV on screen right now, so go grab it. Thanks for watching.